Hello everyone and welcome to another SQL query training session with Learn at NoStar. In today's session, we are going to answer another tricky SQL query question asked in interviews and that is that if you want to sort your data, keeping certain values always at the top and the other values in that column in an ascending manner, how can that be done? So a common scenario for that is you have a list of country names and you want, uh, let's say, uh, India to be always on top and then all the other countries should then be sorted in an ascending manner. So how can this be achieved? So we have done another video on custom sorting earlier as well. I have provided a link above to that video. So if you want to check that out, you can check that out as well. It has a scenario of sorting by month name or your weekday name. So you can check that out. Now for the question that we are going to answer in this video let's take the example of this country table so we have this table it has got some values in it uh, they are not in any particular order now what we need to achieve here is ordering in a particular way so let's first use the order by clause to sort our data so what we're saying is that we want always the country name of India to be at the top and then all the other values in this country name column can be in an ascending order so we cannot just sort by the country name so let's just do a sort by the country name and that is just going to sort everything in an ascending order now because we want the name of india to be at the top we have to include another clause here which is a case condition so what we're going to say we are going to create a dummy column for ordering through this case statement so we are simply saying case when country name is equal to India then zero so we are going to assign a value and to all the other country names we are going to assign the value of one okay and then end this case statement okay so what it is going to do over here is that if the value in this column is India, it's going to create a dummy column with the value of 0. 0 is obviously lesser than 1. So it is always going to put India at top and all the other countries after that. Now we also want to order the other countries by in an ascending order. So we have to include another column which is country name. So in this case, now we are ordering by two columns. The first priority will be given to the first column by which we are ordering. So first, uh, the data set will be ordered by this particular case condition where the India would be put on the top and then it would sort the data again by the country name. So this would be a sub sorting that would be happening now if we execute this query we would be getting a desired result so India is at the top and then all the other countries are in an ascending order now let's say we have two countries that we want to be on the top so we want India to appear as the first country in the list and then we want Singapore to appear as a second country in the list so what we need to do here is just add to a case condition add another statement to a case condition saying when country name equal to Singapore then now this in this case we are going to give a value to Singapore which is more than the value that we have given to India because we'll be sorting in an ascending manner and to all the other countries we have to give a value which is greater than both of these values so let's say we give it the value of 2 okay and now let's execute this query so what we have got over here is we have got India and Singapore at the top and then all the other remaining countries have been sorted in an ascending order. So this is how you can achieve this custom sorting. Again, it's a very simple solution that we have. The only approach um, and thing that you need to keep in mind is that in this case, we need to create a dummy column with the case statement uh, where we write our ordering criteria and then we include the other column on which we want to sort in an ascending manner. I hope that you found this video useful. If you did, then please do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll be posting many more videos soon. Also, if you have any questions, SQL queries, please do write them in the comments below. We'll try to answer all the queries as soon as we can. Thanks a lot for watching. Goodbye.